Today we're going to review the latest Apple iPad Mini. This is the Apple iPad Mini 4. It has a 7.9 inch display with a resolution of 2048 by 1536. It also features wireless and Bluetooth connectivity, has a 10 hour battery life, an 11 megapixel rear facing camera, and only weighs about 10.4 ounces. So let's open it up and test it out. Here's the charger, the power block, and it looks like that's everything. You can see a lot of just detail even in the Apple logo when it turns on. It's asking me to set it up. So you can tell already that it has both a 2.4 GHz and a 5 GHz radio. So I'm going to go ahead and pick the higher frequency, enter my secret password. I'll set up a touch ID later. Um, it wants me to create a passcode, but what if I don't want one? I guess it needs it. It wanted me to take a picture of a credit card <clears throat> to put that on file, but if I want to buy things from the Apple Store, I'll do that later. Okay. The interface looks really responsive, really nice. How much is the Apple iPad?
Oh, I gotta say, hey Siri. Hey Siri. Hey Siri. How much is the Apple iPad? Here's some information. Pretty nifty. Considering I'm a noob and don't really know how to use the Apple iPad yet, that was uh, fairly easy to figure out. Let's see how the camera is. Looks really clear. Oh wow, yeah, I like that. Looks good. I hope there's not a glare on the screen, but it, it definitely takes great pictures with the 11 megapixel rear camera. Overall, I like it. I like how thin it is. Um, it's lightweight, but it still feels sturdy. It feels like you're not gonna you know, break it. It doesn't feel flimsy or anything like that. And I mean, the screen resolution is just amazing. I mean, I need to zoom in on this and let you actually see just the detail that's going on in here. It's um, it's not like any other uh, tablet device I've ever seen. Also, the um, the background moves when you move the device, so it kind of adds like a third dimension to it. Like you can see the background moving underneath the icons and that makes a really cool effect going on. I want to see if I can find a uh, benchmarking software just to see how well this does under uh, stress. So let's get a benchmark app. just installing real quick and then after that we'll run it. All right. Now considering this is running in a 2K resolution, it's actually doing a really high frame rate. Um, I mean obviously a lot better than I expected it to be. There's only a few tablets that are going to have this kind of frame rate and this kind of performance and it's something you're really not going to see in any of the budget lower end Android tablets or even the previous generation iPad minis. As you can see by the chart here, the iPad Mini 4 scored, you know, fairly higher than the iPad Air, the iPhone 5S, the Mini 2, or even the iPad 4, which, uh, you know, that may be a generation behind because they made the Mini afterward. And uh, this scored in the top 20 for the fifth generation iPad. I want to give you an idea of how sharp the display is. Some of the more interesting features of the Apple iPad 4 Mini are uh, the ability to unlock the device by using your fingerprint, and also 
the uh, accelerometer changing the background of the device as you move it. And also I wanted to test how the uh, speakers sound. So I'm going to download Google Play Music and log into my account through that. The audio is very clear on these speakers. They sound phenomenal. You can actually hear the bass very well, too. You can even use the fingerprint reader for your uh, Apple Pay account so that nobody can use your credit card unless you put your thumb you know, on the uh, fingerprint reader. So this thing has uh, Siri, iOS 9, a fingerprint reader, um, exceptional battery life. I mean, it lasts like 10 hours. So. In all, I would definitely recommend checking this out. I'm going to put a link in the description so that you can look at it yourself and uh, decide that if you like it or not, you know, you can you can check out the specifications and the price and and all of that. So, yeah, check it out. Uh, tell me what you think in the comments. And if you want to keep seeing more reviews, just like and subscribe. Thank you for watching Top 10 Product Reviews.